Well, hello everybody. I am inside a hotel right now, but I did not want to leave you guys hanging with no video for today. So today we're going to do some very pleasant sounding fun facts with Discord. All right? All right. A lot of reptiles love being handled and cuddled. The warm heat of humans is very enjoyable for the cold-blooded animals. And added just in case, don't actually go around picking up random reptiles. Not all of them are friendly. If you have a reptile pet though, take him out and spend time with them a lot. They're sure to appreciate it. My brother actually has iguanas and he does the same thing with them all the time. Rattlesnakes have learned to not shake their rattles around people to protect themselves. They'll only rattle if discovered in the open. Well, rattlesnakes, you're supposed to do stealth checks. Don't, don't do that. It's actually not dangerous to wake someone up if you see them sleepwalking. The most you'll get is probably an irritated and sleepy friend, but it's safer to wake them up and return them to bed than having them possibly get hurt when walking around. I have to do this with my dad 24 seven. He is a sleepwalker and it's just, he has crashed into the fridge once. So if I hear him fumbling around downstairs, I just gently tap him on the shoulder and say, dad, go back to bed, please. Coming back to life after being clinically dead and have CPR having failed to work is known as having Lazarus syndrome. Causes still up debate, but there are several thought causes. One of such theories is that pressure is built up in the chest due to CPR, and once the pressure loosens and gives the heart space to expand. This brings up ethical issues, such as when you should retrieve organs from organ donors and do autopsies on the body. However, if too long is waiting to see if circulation will start again, organs from organ donors may die or become unstable, and autopsies may become more difficult. Most people who have experienced Lazarus Syndrome report death to be a very peaceful nothingness, and do not fear death any longer. Some even go as far to say they can't wait to go back. Damn. People who take longer and usually hotter showers tend to be lonely people, according to Yale's emotion researches. Scientists have actually known for a while that social warmth or coldness can be caused by physical warmth or coldness and vice versa. The study showed that people who were deprived of social warmth were literally seeking it out in the bathroom. Damn again. Less a fun fact and more of a life hack. A good substitute for soda is to mix normal sparkling water with a flavor with low calories. For example, Crystal Light Lemonade. Tastes just like soda, but much less calories. I've done this before. It actually does work pretty well. Not quite there yet, but honestly, if you're trying to quit soda, it might help. In Minecraft, you can color beacons, right? But if you want to make the ultra gay beacon, it looks bad because of chunky glass, but you can use glass panes and you won't even see the smallest bit of it. Now go make your gay bean, you're welcome. And finally, in order to understand a pun, your brain uses both left and right hemispheres because of the unique structure of the joke. Maybe that's why most people say their head hurts after they hear one. 